My name is Tiger Yotsuwat. I graduated from CSFC in 2016, and now I'm in the middle of completing my final year undergraduate degree in physics at the University of Cambridge. My childhood was a good mix between the busy, fast-paced lifestyle of living in the center of Bangkok, but um, also the more relaxed environment of growing up outside of the city. Uh, my mom worked from home to take care of us, so I'd spend a lot of time just watching her work. Uh, my dad would go to town to work, but would come back home with nice takeaway food, so we really looked forward to that part of the day. Uh, I grew up playing with my brother and a couple of our neighbors. We'd go on cycling trips, uh, climbing at the playground, and all the things that kids used to do. Um, later, we moved to central Bangkok, closer to my parents' office. Um, there, there were shopping malls, food, and the buzz of living in a big city. But one thing I didn't really enjoy was having to wake up earlier to get to school uh, because of the traffic. Uh, at school, I was quiet and shy um, and introverted, but there were a few close friends and several of them came to CSFC with me. So my childhood was uneventful, but it was really fun. When I was younger, I wanted to be a lot of things, and I still do, um, but mainly a scientist, an inventor, and an entrepreneur. Um, I always loved machines and technology, and I remember one story that my mom always uh, told me, and it was mostly her complaining about how hard it was to raise me as a... Um, but the story was about how it was really hard to get me to eat anything as a toddler and the only way was to bring me out to construction sites and while I was focused on watching the construction trucks work um, she would be able to stuff food into my mouth without me turning away uh, so yeah I was, I was very interested in seeing how stuff worked even back then and at school I finished my GCSE physics exams early and so um, I asked my teacher if I could work on my side project while everyone was doing their experiments. Um, and so I decided to build a Stirling engine um, during my free time. And it was just really fun um, fiddling with all the different components and trying to get this thing to work. And so that's why I wanted to be an, uh, an inventor as well. My favorite memory from CSFC has to be cooking pasta and solving riddles late at night with my cluster mates. But in terms of what actually happened in college, this has to be the International Space Settlement Design Competition in Florida. Um, it was a tough competition, but it brought everyone closer together. And also at the end of it, we got to spend time exploring Florida and uh, we, we went to the Universal Studio, so it was great fun. my greatest success so far. Um, I think that's getting an offer to the University of Cambridge along with a scholarship from the Cambridge Trust. I have a pretty fixed routine Monday to Friday and since it's my final year now uh, it's very focused on the research project so I plan my week centered around um, going to the lab. Um, I'm a pretty active person, so I, so I like to run a lot. So in the morning, I would plan a five kilometer run to the lab and that would be my workout for the day. Um, at the end of the day, I would come back home and most importantly, find time to relax. And this I alternate between watching Netflix, reading a book and playing games. My biggest challenge in life so far has been um, dealing with loss and getting through uh, depression. And um, 
during that period, I was very behind on lectures and uh, there was no way for me to catch up in time for exams. Um, so I had to find some way to motivate myself to work and also rediscover my passion for physics as well. Um, so the way that I dealt with that was to reach out to friends and academic advisors for support and you know you quickly learn that when you really need them people are there for you so um, those were tough times but um, there was a good support system for me um, I managed to get through the exam period and here I am now If I were to use three words to describe myself, it would be self-motivated, uh, focused, and curious. <laughs>